Okay, greetings and salutations. My name is Tish and welcome to the Artist Haven, where home plus art equals heart. In tonight's live video broadcast, I am going to play a little bit around with um, some satin enamel paint, the Dutch Boy version. Well, this is a combination of the Dutch Boy version and the satin enamels from Americana Decor, Deco Art stuff. And it's a combination of Artist Loft Flow Acrylic and Artist Loft Titanium White. Um, I've got two things here. One is not um, watered down, and I watered down this to put as the backdrop. This painting, I don't like the way it dried. It has this big blue blob, sad little part right here. This is cool. This is cool, but this is sad. <laughs> so I thought, man, nah, let's just pour over that. Because I was cleaning the studio today in attempts to build my other drying rack and figuring out how I want to build the other one. If I want to build it exactly the same as the one I have, or if I want to do it slightly different, the components are slightly different, but for the most part, it's going to be the same. Um, cause that's going to be more for, um, the second one's going to be more for, uh, resin projects. So I want to leave the shelf spaces a little bit further apart so I can put a little dome on them. And I have an idea for that. And I will show you that when I get it created, which will be tomorrow. I spent a good chunk of my day cleaning and reorganizing my kitchen and, clearing out the hallway and doing the studio stuff. I have been busy, 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 busy. And it's fun, fun, fun because it's starting to look so cool. I'm so excited. But um, I got my boards cut for the um, drying rack and I will start putting those components together tomorrow because tonight while watching the Rhinestone World live, which y'all need to do, um, I will be cleaning my room and making it so I can actually walk in there because I put everything that was in the studio in there and now I got to put all it back. So I'm just mixing this up. This is this with a, a Floetrol and Water 50-50 mix. So it's a little bit thinner and I'm going to dump this on here because we are going to do, actually we're going to mix up what colors we want to use and put some Astro Glide in there, otherwise known as Demythicone. I don't think I'm going to be using this guy anymore. He's kind of sad now. Dude, now my heart's broken. Oh wait, you know what? Ha ha ha. That is why they make scissors. We'll just cut that part right off. Hello Jason! Hello Blair! If you put Astro Glide in your black background color. You know, I don't know. I don't think I've ever done that. It's a good idea. It's a good idea. That's a good idea for an experiment. Which. Hmm. I got an idea for that. We will do that tomorrow. I'm, I'll write that down so I remember. Because <laughs> that's a good idea. And I have some other paint mixed up that is already for like a Dutch pour. Like it's a thinner consistency that I can add Astroglide to. And then, I know, I don't know either. I think that would be a good idea. Because I don't think I've ever seen anybody do that. And I've watched a lot of videos and I don't remember seeing a video like that because I think I would remember putting silicone in the background color. Because everybody says, well, they're not putting it in their background color. Well, why not? Why? <laughs> I sound like a two-year-old. Why? <laughs> okay, so, dude, I got paint on this. Okay, so we're going to move. We'll move him over here. I got my table behind me. I can put them on there. Okay. 
I got all this stuff in my, I've been doing dishes like all day. <laughs> well, not all day. I do dishes for a while, let them air dry, and then put them away and do another batch. And I did my, some of my arting dishes first, so that way I could do it in a dirty sink. Dirty sink. So, okay. Let me see here. We need little cups. These will look perfect. No, these are kind of big even. Well, let's go for it. Let's do four colors, because that's what kind of cups I got. So, move that out of the way. Hey, that was my beads. Okay, so, I'm just looking over what I got here. Let's do... Doo -doo. I was thinking, since it's Thanksgiving... Let's do some kind of Thanksgiving colors-ish. I've got orange, because, you know, pumpkin. Even though I don't like it, I still respect it. <laughs> See, I'm trying to find some colors that'll go well with orange, but then I've got all these containers that I just pushed. Oh, no, I don't want that one. Ooh, let's do this one. Because I haven't done this one in a while. This is that zinc. Okay. And gold. Well, I think orange and gold kind of clash. But you still got to have some gold. I'm trying to find the one that I've been looking for, but I can't ever seem to find it. I still have to reorganize all my all my paints here. Okay, hang on a second. I know it's in here somewhere. No, don't fall. Okay, where'd I go? and that should be good okay this is that hooker's green I like this green hello Brenda yay okay so I'm doing kind of a Thanksgiving themed kind of we're just gonna do the four colors in white so I've got this hooker's green. This is the gold from um, the this gold, this uh, Deco Art Americana Decor Metallics, and these are on sale for thirty percent off at Hobby Lobby, at least in my area. So, and we're gonna put some Astroglide in the green and the orange, and maybe. I don't know. We'll see. I just feel like there needs to be some red in here. So I'm going to put these two aside. There needs to be some red. So I've got this quinacridone red orange. I know that 30% off, I'm like, dude, that means, because they have gallery wrap canvases for 70% off, and then, so they take the initial 70% off, and then you pay 30%, then they take another 30% off of that, and I'm like, dude, that's like almost free. So let's do a little bit of red, because you got to have apple. Mm-mm-mm. I've been looking for a really dark red <clears throat> that's not this red, but like a darker red. Okay, and then the orange, and then I'm trying to think what else. 
Well, here in Minnesota, it'd be blue because we're supposed to be getting snow starting tomorrow night. So we'll see what happens. So, you know, snowflakes and stuff. We've got a big chance of mud right here. That's okay. I haven't used some of these colors in a while, so this one's a little bit watery. Not watery. It's a little bit thinner than... And you know what? I'm going to add a little bit of regular red to that just to make it a little bit more rich. Actually, let's get the real red out. Let's burn it. Let's put a blob of red in there just to, just because we can. I'll thicken it up a little bit, make it a little bit more of a rich red. Set that there because I don't want to walk it all the way back. I need a stick. A stick. There we go. I need a little bit of yellow in there. What? The hooker's green. Not yet. It's gonna have a, it's gonna have astroglide in it. Oh, that's right. This one doesn't squirt because I gotta find the and then I say squirt. Ha, ah, I found my stick. Ha ah. ha. Had a little clump of paint in there. Little, hopefully it'll squirt now. Okay, let's get the clump of paint out of there. <laughs> let's put a little bit of yellow in there. We're kind of mixing colors on the fly. There, I like that. Well, maybe a little bit more yellow. Yeah, a little bit more yellow. Dude. Just a little bit. There we go. See, it's not quite as red, but it's not, it's a little bit better of an orange. It's not a blazing orange. Yeah, it's a little bit, a little bit thicker. <laughs> you guys. See, that's why I needed to come live today because I have been so focused and so working hard and trying to get things done. I still have a lot of things to do yet tonight and tomorrow. But you guys make me laugh and take away a lot of my stress that I it's self-imposed stress. Don't get me wrong. Okay. Yeah, I like that. That's a nice rich orange. Okay, so we're going to put Astroglide in these colors. And we need one more. <sighs> I'm wondering if we should do the Payne's Gray. Just to kind of give more contrast. Because I'm not going to put Astroglide in the metallics. Just because I don't want to. Hmm. I think five is good enough. We'll just go with what we got. Cushions. <laughs> is that anything like Hoovians? <laughs> oh, that's awesome. 
Oh my goodness. Okay, come on. Oh, I've been cleaning. I took all... Doris has a friend, and I can't remember what her name is, but she collects all these skins, and man, she's going to love me. <laughs> and I got like four boards worth of... Well, yeah, four boards worth of skins together. I have one already rolled up and ready to go. Okay, Astroglide. No pink. I'm, I'm trying to go Thanksgiving colors here. Well, and borderline Christmas, but holiday colors. Orange, red, green, gold. And this is kind of my, ch you don't want charcoal in your stocking. So this is Hooker's Green and we're going to put Astro Glide in her. There we go. Give this a good stir. Disperse that astro glide. I can't tell if it's peaking or not. It's just dripping. Come on. Yeah, that's good enough. And then we need another stick. Stick, stick, stick. I hope we need more hookers green. Okay. I think I just like saying that. <laughs> yeah, I think that would be a bad thing too. Unless she's, you know, got lots of money. She's in the green, you know. Or he. You can't, you know, be gender biased. This is a nice fit. This is nice. Okay, so we're only going to do one of this, I think. I don't know. We're going to set these aside. And I actually want to move this tonight, too. So, all right. Here comes the fugly painting. More nice and tight. So, it's tight for the hooker. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, bother. Near, near, near. Okay, I'm going to keep him tipped upside down while we smooth the rest of this out. Like baseball cards. No. Same difference, Jason. Just because they're men doesn't mean they get a cool name. Okay, so I want like super uber coverage on this, so I'm trying to keep it as thick as I can. So I've been thinking about going through my pantry. Now you gotta remember my pantry is like, I don't know, probably five foot by five foot square, maybe a little bit bigger, six by six, and it's eight feet tall. 
and there's a lot of stuff in that pantry. But I've been thinking about going through it and pulling out some of the stuff from my baking that I can replace later. One of them is one of my big offset spatula. Well, it's not real big. It's a little bit bigger than this, though. But I'm, I don't want to... It's like I have memories with those spatulas. So I don't want to... I don't know. There's a couple in there, though, I think that it will be... That will be good to use because I don't have a bond with them yet. Because the reason why... I started doing the acrylic floors is because I thought it would look cool on furniture and I actually have a project that we're going to be doing this week as soon as I get everything um, organized. Because as soon as I get organized and I can move the camera in different positions throughout the studio and I don't have to worry about it wiggling. Because wiggling is bad. I don't want to make people motion sick. That motion sickness thing is a real thing. I know because I get it. That's why I'm afraid to fly. Part of it. I don't want to puke in front of other people. That's embarrassing. Come on, baby. Come on. There we go. All right. Let's get this side. A little bit off the back. Oh, squeak. Sorry, guys. <laughs> There's a girl that I'm training at work. She's a sweet thing. But, uh, she had to use a file to scrape some of the paint. And it was metal on metal. And she was just like, Ehh! like fingernails on chalkboard type thing. And I'm like, what? <laughs> Made me think of Mrs. Nyhammer. She used to, she had really long fingernails. She was my sixth grade teacher. And she would come in and to get everybody's attention, she'd scrape her fingers on the finger, on the chalkboard. So it's like, I kind of became immune to it. I think it had the opposite effect on me. It's like, well, at least someone wants us to pay attention. Normally, I wouldn't pay so much attention to the sides, but because this is going to be a chunky swipe, these sides aren't going to get any love. So, I need to dip in there. I need to give it some love over here. Okay, because I'm all out of white in here. I should go put this in the sink real quick, but I'll rinse it out later. Ah, hell. Okay. I think I got it now. Alright, now I need a... There we go. Uh-oh. Pour on the brim when it comes? Brooke! Hello, Brookie! Okay. <laughs> I'm not drunk. I just feel that way. Oh, knocking crap over. Oh, good thing I bought a new box of shop towels because this is my last. Well, there's two. Oh, no, there's three. Oh, jeez. I would have been sad. So when I wipe off my knife, the, the, the palette knife, not a, not a real knife. Don't get your boxes in a bunch. I gotta get better at that whole Instagram thing. Ugh. <laughs> I See, I never got in the habit of posting on there because I had a POS phone for the longest time. And now I have a really nice phone. So I'm trying to get in the habit of doing that kind of stuff. And yeah, it's not happening. Okay. Oh yeah, that was the other thing. 
<laughs> I go out my refrigerator because I went grocery shopping last week, right? And I bought all this orange juice. I bought two things of orange juice and a bunch of cranberry juice and blah, blah, blah. So I put the orange juice in the back to keep it cold, you know, because I had two things of orange juice. So I put them in a row. Well, I pull out the second orange juice and it's frozen solid. <laughs> I'm like, what is this crap? So I have cranberry, what is it? Cranberry plum and something else, pomegranate, I think. Well, see, here's the thing with rags. I have plenty of rags that I use for my, like, when I'm washing stuff down and stuff like that. Things that, products that can be actually washed. Acrylic paint doesn't wash out. So, I'd just be throwing away, you know, rags. This way, the paper ones, at least they're, you know, biodegradable. I get them. The reason why I like the Scott ones is because they're like 50% recycled, recycled paper, something like that. So, all right, let's do, oh, we got a little off. Oh, well, I guess we're going to be a little off today. <clears throat> okay. I'm going to do the gold blast. Well, second to last. Okay, we got Astro Glide in the orange. Let's do, yeah. Let's do the red. I don't know how this is going to turn out. It might be a lot of mud. It might be pretty cool. I don't know. We're going to see. Then I'll do the gold. We'll do the red. And then I'm going to do a stripe of white, a little bit of white on top, too. And we'll do a little bit of white. Chunky guy. Hi, Elisa. Oh. Okay. Sorry, my arm is going doing its thing. Okay. You know what? I think I'm going to do. Just because I can, I'm going to put a line of this down here and up here. There. I don't know why. Just wanted to. Okay. So. Get what? Okay, great. Oh boy. All right. Oops. What is this too? Oh my gold. Okay. Put that back on there. Let's do a little guy right here. Actually, let's do this little guy. 
Let's go up to here. Du, du, du. Okay. All right, I need to move these sticks because I need to have. Uh, I need to have space. I need space. Stuff is taking up my space. Okay. So I have these old sewing cabinet things that I'm going to turn into beverage stations. And um, I'm going to do this ghost swipe like this on there. Holy Toledo. Okay. And I found the metal uh, putty knife that I wanted to use the other day. So... We're going to bring him down and see how he does. It's kind of it's kind of hard to be light-handed with him cuz he's so heavy. So we're going to try again. Okay, let's go with this guy. Let's see if we can pick up some of that green. Okay, let's do Fingerling. Come here, my little fingerling. Let's see, stick it right there. And where'd my little little guy go? There he is. There he is, my little little guy. I'm gonna bring Got to have a couple of crooked ones. I'm trying to decide if I should do one right there. <clears throat> Good beverage station? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking too. But I need to find a... I might actually use this red. And maybe the hooker's green even too. Um, because I want to do one in Viking colors, and then one, I have two. I want to do one in Viking colors, and then one in Minnesota wild colors, but do something like this on the side of it, and then on the little flippy part, too. So, I'm going to do one right here, just because I can. 
Here we go, halfway. Okay. Time to flip. I'm gonna flip this guy too. She's not wiping off the paint. Like he's supposed to. Jeez. Okay, so this might be interesting because it's so short. So, I didn't intentionally do that, so we're gonna work with it. Let's get out Chunky Guy. And we're gonna start Chunky Guy right about here. like that. I wonder what would happen if I use, because it's got the little, little ones. These are like 1 16th of an inch. These are 1 8th inch. These are a quarter inch. And these are a quarter inch too. But these are like, I think they're a quarter inch. I don't know. I can't read it anymore. It's covered in paint. So I'm going to try these little ones. And I'm going to do it just in the edge of the green here. And push up and pull back. Wow, that's really cool. Dude. Let's try that again over here. Push up and pull back. Dude, dude, I love this chunky guy. One time could I pull at a diagonal and have it kind of a like a feather effect? Really? <laughs> Brooke. Oh, Brooke. I love you. <laughs> I just had this picture of a dog in my head, like looking at you slyly, like, I'm going to do this. Just look away, ma'am. Just look away. <laughs> okay. I call everybody dude. I don't care who you are. I call, I called our, uh, our, not the plant manager. Well, actually, yeah, I did call Randy dude once. I'm like, dude, how's it going? <laughs> you know, he's like the, like the guy that runs the whole plant. And I'm calling him dude. I just call everybody dude. It's a term of endearment to me. I even call Jason dude. Okay, so angle what? I need to try pulling at a diagonal. If I'm going to do that, I got to do it with something little and light. So let's try it. Let's bring this down. Like that? Or do you mean? That's still kind of cool. Yep, yeah, everyone's dude. If I call you sweetheart and I'm angry, <laughs> I might as well call you, you know, the MF thing. <laughs> Ooh. 
Legos. Legos. <laughs> I'm I'm not laughing at at you. I'm laughing with you. How how do you make? How am I supposed to do at an angle? I don't understand. Oh, you know what I could do? Hang on, let's try it. And not put your finger in the paint dish. Jeez, oh Pete. Well, that isn't exactly what I was going for, but it's still kind of cool. <clears throat> I'll have to practice that off camera because I shake too much. <laughs> Plus, I've had two cups of coffee today. I usually only have one. And when I say cup, I mean like the to-go cups from like gas stations. So, yeah, I'm trying to balance it out with some juice. I don't know how to do them. I don't know. I don't know. You're asking me about my skill set. Okay. So we're going to bring. Actually, you know what? Oh, he's too fat. I don't like her, you can have her, she's too fat for me. Okay, so we're going to come up here and lay it down. And we're going to slide it. Try not to wiggle too much. Nope. Okay, now I'm purposely wiggling. Okay, so that red really looks like blood. <laughs> oh, super styling. Okay. Where's my little finger guy? Hey, we got this guy. No, he's too big. Let me see. I want to try something. Dude, I keep putting my finger in the paint. Okay, I don't like that. You know, maybe I'll like it. I don't like it right now. But we still gotta torch this and figure out, finish out the... <sighs> Where'd my little guy go? What did I do with him? Oh! Did he fall off? Yep, he fell off into the abyss. That is the rest of my table. Okay. So... We're going to kind of peek up in here and we'll press it all down. Okay, let's flip this out. There we go. I'm going to press this guy.
I'm going to take a drop of green right there. There we go. Okay. Let me bring Oop, that one went a little bit jagged. That's okay. All right, I'm gonna torch this a little bit. <laughs> oh, bother, you guys. You know what song I had stuck in my head for like all day today? And I've been listening to music to try and get rid of it. And it's still just stuck there. Because people keep talking about Copa. Or Coppa. But they keep saying Copa. And you know what song has Copa in it? Think about it. Y'all are my age-ish. It's been in my head all day long. All day long. Thanks, Travis. for replanting that song in my head. Okay, up we go. Okay, let's get it back kind of in the middle again. And we're gonna tip it. Now you started that one, Brooke. You mentioned it tonight, not me. Okay. I like that better. There we go. It's kind of warped. I like it. It's kind of how I'm feeling right now. <clears throat> okay. So let's get this back. Kind of in the middle again. All right. 
Here we go. Eh, my finger's stuck to the bottom. Okay, so I gotta hold on to the back here because I gotta do some actual finger painting. Because I stuck my finger to the painting. Look at that. This is my favorite. Right there. That's my favorite. Okay. But the rest of this is pretty flippin' cool. So, I'm gonna make sure. Okay. Turning. Dude. Well, now it's got a little blue on it. Oh, well. That's really cool, too. And a little bit of cells. So... Yep. Okay, let's see. Oh, good lord. I look up and I see pulling poop. <laughs> I'm like, really? I needed to see this? Why? <laughs> Why? I, no! You guys... Beautiful. You guys are evil. This is way beyond anything I ever imagined it could be. There's no mud. Look, look. It's all brilliant colors. Look what that gold did too. Because there is no... Do you see those cells? Do you? Do you see them? Do you see those? They're green and gold. And look. Kind of alligator cells right there. Oh, my heart be going a pittery pattery. Okay. So. I like it. It. I thought you said hooter green. I'm like, what? There's green. See, there's green there. There's green in there. There's some green in there, and there's some green. There's a lot of green, actually. <clears throat> Just can't really see it because of the glare, because it's still wet. It's wet hooker green. <laughs> oh, bother. Look out up there. There's something up there. What is that? I don't know. I'm leaving it. It's kind of, kind of belongs there, I guess. Okay. Meanwhile, back at the ranch. I'm just going to kind of bring some of this color in here. Yeah, because I can. Okay. <sighs> and I had clean hands. I mean, I've been doing dishes all day. <laughs> okay, so we're going to save these for another pour. So, I need to wipe off my hands. Oh, maybe come to Tish. There we go. It's the itsy bitsy. <laughs> the itsy bitsy spider. <laughs> the muckers are sneaky. Yep, they are. I zoom in a bit you know there is a way to do it on my phone but I don't know how <laughs> I, le I know how to when it's just the camera but I don't know how to on Streamlabs because that's what I'm using right now and I guess they're starting to make people pay for it so I don't know if I'll be using Streamlabs for very much longer because you know what I'm I'm a poor artist and even though I'm working overtime still have things planned for next year that I need to pay for 
one of them means taking off a couple of weeks from work, which means I have to have money saved up for said time off from work. I'm grateful that uh, the trip to Vegas is happening over Easter time, except for airfare is going to be insane. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Drink, don't drive, do the watermelon crow. I love that song. I remember that song. That was back when line dancing was a popular thing. I actually kind of missed that. That was a good workout. And you got to have fun. And yes, I did go da line dancing. Once I got to go line dancing. I practiced and practiced and practiced. And I got to go once. But then again, that was the 90s. 90s weren't always good to me. <laughs> That's why I'm looking forward to better times. Because, you know what? It's the end of a decade. Not only is it the end of a year, it's the end of a decade. And this decade has been an interesting one. I won't say it's been bad, and I won't say it's been good. But it's been interesting. This next decade... You watch. We're going to have phenomenal. It's going to be phenomenal. And it's gonna, there's going to be hard times. But there's going to be a lot more good times than hard times, y'all. Dudes. <laughs> oh, yeah. And by the way, I, I took over Miss Cleo's job. And so now I'm going to predict your future. <laughs> you guys are like, she's nuts. What are we doing with her? She's nuts. Yep, I'm nuts. I'll admit it. I'm nuttier than squirrel turds. This is kind of morphing into something a little bit more than I had planned for. I wish this would have moved. Because all of this moved. This, just this didn't. Like, what? Anywho. Uh, no, we didn't have a mechanical bowl. <laughs> you are funny, Brooke. I'm not going to say anything. <laughs> I'm pleading the fifth. <laughs> Save a horse, ride a cowboy. <laughs> Sweet little baby Jesus. <laughs> oh. I have to ask the question though, Brooke. Do you have to put quarters in them in order to get them to work? just wondering because you know where are the controls <laughs> what if he shorts out does it I mean you know <laughs> does that happen <laughs> no just ask Clyde <laughs> poor Jason's probably 18 shades of red right about now <laughs> goes into the bank and asks for a hundred dollars in quarters <laughs> or pie <laughs> well honey let me teach you how to make some really good pie crust then <laughs> I 
I should do a video, but you know what? <clears throat> I only have a little three cup um, food processor because my big food processor, I don't know what happened to it. It got lost in the move. I don't know where it went, but I've been looking for it for three years and I can't find it. Oh, <laughs> Shh. okay, focus. <laughs> bye, bye, Miss American, bye. Anywho, the sugar helps with the stamina. <laughs> oh boy, put a new one and you'll find it. Okay, Whew. it's getting a little hot in here. <laughs> like literally, it's getting warm in here. <laughs> Talking about things I don't know about. Let's fan that off a little bit. Okay, still wish this would move. Nope, he's not moving. He's stubborn. <sighs> Notice how Jason goes eerily quiet. <laughs> no. PG-13. Remember, Lair? PG-13. <laughs> oh, bother. Okay. A shower. <laughs> it's warm. It's definitely warm in here. Well, I turned up my heat because I had the a window open last night and I forgot to close it, so it was cold in here. So I turned up the heat and I think I forgot to turn it back down. <laughs> that went out the what? Hey, that's the name of the paint. Is Hooker's Green? What am I supposed? What am I supposed to do about it? It's not my fault. No, I'm not naked. No. Um, I have shorts on and a short sleeve shirt. That's as close as it comes. <laughs> Aster Glide and Hooker's Green. We got the combination. Because look at the, the, uh, the guys, dudes. Look, this is this. this. This, this is cool. Hooker's green right there. And and more hooker's green right there. And a little bit there and a little bit there. And all of this is green. And green and green. That that hooker, she gets around. But, you know, there's this green. And this green. And this green. See, yeah, she's, she's everywhere. <laughs> yep. <clears throat> Definitely didn't keep it in line either. It's twisted. Definitely twisted. I like it. <laughs> Damn, she got paid. Well, there's a lot of gold on there too, so she got paid her weight in gold. Stuck in the middle with you. That's exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> oh, guys. <laughs> I know what happened to Jason. Jason! <laughs> Blue, where are you? Oh, he's probably in the bathroom, probably <laughs> just hiding from his phone. He doesn't even want to touch it. <laughs> yeah, a couple can't say your kid's content. Nope. 
nope, <laughs> not even close. Although, we have not sworn. It's all innuendo. Because we are using hooker. I will find the bottle. Because it says hooker's green. And I will find the bottle. Because it's the mythicone, which creates cells. But it just happens to be called the astroglide. So it's totally innocent adult fun. Oh, man. I can't even wipe my eyes because my hands are all full of pee. <laughs> Uh, ugh, I need to clean my glasses. No wonder I can't read the screen. They're all dirty. Jason. Jason's more red. Jason is, is probably 30 shades of red right now. You know, Brenda, I'm going to tell you a little story. <laughs> Cuss if you need to. Just mark it uh, age appropriate. You can't monetize it. Come down the road. But I let the F-bomb flow in a couple of my uh, videos. Because I was very emotional. And I didn't realize what I was saying. Because normally in real life. Honey. <laughs> the sailor ain't got nothing on me. I learned by the best. My daddy was in the Navy. <laughs> And he taught me well, along with all his Navy buddies and the bar buddies. And I knew more curse words at the age of five than any five-year-old should know. <clears throat> I don't, and to be honest with you, I don't have the, the cuss filters up. I don't have any filters up. The only thing, I think I do have one filter that's like the sub for sub kind of bullshit. Oh, there we go. Kind of BS that I don't want on our chats because that's not how I work. Um, unless I'll subscribe. If you subscribe to my channel, I see you and it's you have something that I want to see. Cool. But if you are, you know, a gaming channel, I'm not into that. I mean, I like watching people play video games, but... Not Fortnite and not Minecraft. Because Minecraft makes me think of Jason and then I miss Jason. Because we had like a week long binge of playing Fortnite. Or Minecraft. I have an epic castle built, I tell you what. Hubby from the Navy and Daddy a Marine. <laughs> oh, there we go. See, Brenda, you and I. <laughs> Aw, you're so cute, Tina. Blush a little bit. Aw. <laughs> yeah, but we'll be la we'd have you laughing and blushing, not just blushing. There's Jason. <laughs> so how many shades of red are you, babe? <laughs> Probably more red than this painting, eh? <laughs> oh, we didn't. We need to have blue because you can see his blue eyes shining through all the red. <laughs> oh. Okay, Ugh. I got everything covered, 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 covered. Didn't we have one more? Oh, that's this one. This one's going, I'm going to rinse this one out in the sink. <laughs> Honey, I think you're, Brooke. I think you're amongst friends, and I don't think you're going to offend any of us that are here tonight. Or, and if you're offended by something someone says, I'm sorry, but 
we're allowed to speak our mind and I would defend anybody as long as it wasn't hate speech you know because that no one needs that no one needs that negative stuff we're doing all this and and light-hearted fun so it's not we're not poking at anybody we're not poking the bear although never mind I'll keep my <laughs> keep my comment to myself. Lou, 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 lou. <laughs> I'll be a good girl. <laughs> I'm offended your duck was in the house. Oh boy. I'm so glad I don't have an animal. Taking care of me is hard enough. Which reminds me, I need to go feed myself. <laughs> I haven't eaten since lunch. <sighs> Brenda. Tina, Brooke, Blair, Elisa, I love you guys, and Jay. It was an issue. <laughs> and Tina. <laughs> I hope I didn't offend you by saying you were cute, but blushing, but I get it. I laugh so hard that my face turns red, my ears turn red. When I drink alcohol of any kind, even just one half of a beer, my ears turn red. It's the German heritage. It my face that gets flush. And I get a little bit more boisterous than normal. So that's why I'm scared to do a tipsy poor challenge. <laughs> but I'm gonna do it live. And I think we're gonna do it on Wednesday night. Because I'm thinking I'm going to go to the store and get a bottle of Kraken. And because I got to go do other stuff tomorrow before the snowstorm hits. <clears throat> so I might just have to stop and do my tipsy poor life. So this might be interesting. I'm definitely marking that one adult. That one is definitely going to be age appropriate. <laughs> <laughs> it comes in dangling poo. <laughs> oh. My Roddy used to be afraid of the air raid, the of the of the severe weather sirens or air raid sirens as I used to call them when I was a kid because that's what they were. He would go he would hear him and he would go hide under the bed, I swear. <laughs> oh, okay. Aw, did we scare Tina away? I hope not. She's so sweet. Oh, you know what magic trick you can do, Blair? Did we scare her away? I hope not. Sorry. Well, Tina, if you come back, we love you. <laughs> and, oh, magic trick. 
you, my dear, if you're on your laptop, I don't know what you're on, can share links. So, did you know that? Did you know that you can share links? But you have to keep them appropriate and no linking outside of Facebook, out of YouTube. Well, unless I ask you to. <laughs> Because as a, as a um, moderator, you get that magic trick. So, next time. Yep, and if you're on your phone, you don't, you don't get to. But if you fire up your laptop, you can. And that's what, um, that's why I like my, that's why I like using my computer when I'm live. <clears throat> yeah, no more dancing troopers. I I got sucked into that for what ten minutes of my life. <laughs> I wanted to see what they did. The dirty dancing was amazing. <laughs> okay. I just <laughs> dancing stormtroopers. That's just yeah. I should. Did you share with Jason? And it was funny. But no, Jason can do it too. But he's on his phone and he doesn't have a laptop. Best he has is a tablet. I don't think you can do it on a tablet either. I think that's considered a mobile. Well, Jason's Jason's probably going and eating supper. Oh yeah. So, cause what time is it? Yeah, it's almost six o'clock. There, his supper's late. He eats supper at 5 o'clock. I don't understand that. I'd be starving by 9. I'd be like, I have to eat something before I go to bed. So I just eat at like 7. 7.30. That way, I'm up for a couple more hours. And I still have a full tummy to, you know, full enough tummy where I don't wake up at 2 o'clock in the morning and decide to raid the fridge. Well, Brookie, if you have her, yeah, Messenger. I don't know if I have her on Messenger or not. Tell her we all love her, Brookie. <clears throat> and hopefully she's okay. We didn't, because we didn't mean to offend her. Yeah, exactly. We all love her. And we hope we didn't offend her. I think it's cute that she blushes. I really do. It's it's endearing. It's not like pinchy cheek cute. It's like endearing and unique. And it makes her her. And that's why we love her. All right, you guys. Oh. <sighs> Now I gotta go figure out what I'm gonna make for dinner. I don't want to dirty up my kitchen. I just spent all day cl cleaning it. I mean, I even I, I even wiped down the outsides of my cupboards. That's how cleaning I was. I just have to sweep and mop and finish up a few more dishes. So, but that's not gonna happen till the morning. I gotta go make some food though. I'm hungry. I got some chicken in the refrigerator that's waiting for me. It's calling my name. And oh, it's Tammy. Hello, Tammy. We're just ready to get going, but ta da! <laughs> so, if you like this video, smash that like button. If you got a grumbly tummy, smash that like button. <laughs> If you liked what you've seen here tonight, and hopefully weren't offended, 
please click that subscribe button and click the little notification bell and that will let you know when we go live on our channel which we are going to do every single day until December 30th 2019 and who knows maybe even after because I really love this I really love talking with you guys so y'all have a great day tomorrow and if I don't see you before Thanksgiving, if you don't get a chance to come on live with me tomorrow or Wednesday or even Thursday, because Thursday I'm probably going to do a couple of lives because, yeah, I'm just going to be busy, busy, busy. So if I don't get a chance to say it to you, happy Thanksgiving. Enjoy your day if you're spending it, even if you're spending it alone like I am. know that I love you and I know the holidays are tough for people but I'm always here you can always message me on Facebook um, or on Inst I think Instagram has messaging or on Twitter I'm on all three so reach out to me and we can chat if you're feeling down so I am grateful you're here I am grateful you spent time with me tonight Peace, love, and happiness.